so for today's video we'll be talking about the new update for our asus rog3 so this is the new update with version 2007.58 it's for the global version or the flash to global version uh, it has updated portrait mode for armory crate it also activated the uh, Volti and Vo Wi-Fi in Norway, Sweden, and Finland. And this is the main issue that some were experiencing. It resolves a conflict between the Netflix app and the system brightness adjustment function. So this is the black crush issue. So in this update, it's supposedly fixed already. And fix a bug where rugs tricks Arian SSD could not be detected. Fix error showing battery percentage and status bar and battery life in battery settings is inconsistent. So, as usual, all you have to do is just like download the update from the link. Because as you can see on the ASUS website, it's not yet available. So you just download the up update from the link. And as soon as you download it, it will be on your downloads folder over here so all you have to do is long press it and then move to internal storage and then click OK so once you're in the internal storage scroll under you'll see the update over there so all you have to do from that is like restart your phone so let's try it out. I'll be restarting my phone and I'll be back to you as soon as uh, the update has been detected and the phone has restarted. Okay? So see you in a while. Okay, so we restarted our phone. As you can see, uh, system update file is detected. It's over up here. So all you have to do is like click on that and then click on OK. And as soon as you do that, you just wait for the update to finish and be installed. So a lot of you has been asking, is there a way to finish this one? Uh, I mean to get rid of this notification, the warning. As you can see, even if there's a warning, the update is still going through. So for the warning, all you have to do is download this one and cleaner. And then just go to ongoing notifications and then from there you can just turn off the this one you can just turn off that one uh, right now I don't think it's gonna work cuz uh, we're, rec we're doing a screen record but it should work if you're not uh, screen recording also if you buy the premium version you can hide it permanently here so every time it reboots you don't have to do that so I think it's very cheap. It's about uh, one or two dollars, if I'm not mistaken. So so far, as you can see, my update here is uh, 2007.47, and I've been using this update for about more than two weeks now, and I didn't have any. I don't face any issues in terms of playing games. Uh, phone is heating up or something so the update is working very well for me I hope it works well for you uh, if you have any questions just leave a comment down below and maybe I could help you out fix your ROG 3 for ROG 2 there's still no current updates so as you can see on the website for ROG 2 here uh, there's still no updates for the ROG 2, so I hope they come out with the, the coming updates because it's been a long time since the ROG 2 has been updated. So nevertheless, for ROG 3, they're doing constant updates now, maybe because it's a new phone. So we just wait for it until it finished. It's, a, it's about 28% already. So all you have to do is just like download that as I said open your file manager and it's supposed to be on your downloads folder then from there you can just uh, move it to your internal storage and it should be 
right here under then from there just restart your phone and click the update so let me know if you have any issues on your phone uh, which you have just flashed to global for now me I'm not having any issues on my phone I've been using it for three weeks now everything's working like the theme store everything wallpapers and everything they're all working perfectly so I don't have any issues I also use gesture controls so everything's working as it should be so I hope that I was able to help you during the flashing of the ROG 3 to global firmware so as you can see right now my security update is on July 1 here July 1 July 1 hopefully after the update this would uh, push my security patch to a later version as I said before I always keep my phone updated and I don't like uh, having my phone not updated because I'm I use a lot of uh, banking apps and I always want my security patches to be up to date to avoid you know I mean issues on that like hacking or something so anyway we're at 51 percent already so let's just wait for that to finish and right after that the update should go through so regarding black crush issue I don't that's why I've been telling you I don't have this I don't have that much issue it's because mainly when I watch my, my Netflix app I don't watch at a very low brightness so I'm not that affected I'm not that affected with the black crush issue though this update according to them will be uh, fixed as you can see here the black crash issue will be fixed on this uh, update so also just leave it onto your it says here do not rename the file place it into your internal directory and reboot so don't extract don't rename just move it to your internal directory and that should upon restarting your device you should be able to detect the update automatically so we're at 71 percent let's just wait for it to finish so what else can i tell you guys uh, right now everything's running smoothly with my phone i use a lot of apps so as you can see maybe you have some apps that you you would like to request as you can see i also have the shark arsenal uh, i use this app mainly to control because I don't like the Asus Aero Cooler. The Asus Aero Cooler doesn't cool my phone that much. Very, very minimal. And for me, I don't think it's really worth it. So I use the Black Shark Cooler, which is a lot, way, way better than using my Asus Cooler. It, I've been playing long games and skipping the degrees up to 35 degrees only. So I, I really recommend using the Black Shark Cooler than. So I also have this new wallpaper. So as you can see, there, that's the way you activate the X mode. So I got this from here. If you want the new wallpaper, just open your Armory Crate and go to your account and then just complete the AR mission. And as soon as you finish the AR mission, you will get a mission reward which is the wallpaper that's on my uh, home screen. So I hope you guys finish that. And as soon as you finish that, you'll be getting this wallpaper. Okay, so we're having, as you can see here, you'll be having this wallpaper additional. These are the available wallpapers now, as you can see, for my phone. My, and the rest are just like stock and still still wallpapers so technically let's wait we're at 98% so after this as you can see the update is at 99% so after this we'll have to restart again the phone for the update to take place so I'll have to stop the video first and get back to you as soon as the 
update is finished again. Okay, so let's wait for it. We're at 99%. Any second now. There. So as you can see, system update successful. Uh, please restart your device. So I'll be restarting my device right now. I'll get back to you as soon as it's finished, okay? So hold on. Okay, so we have just restarted our device. So we just have to wait for it. There, as you can see, it says system update successful. So we just click OK on that. So if you go to settings and then system about here, as you can see, my version is now on the latest version to 2007.58. So let's see the security. Well, it's still at July 1, so it hasn't updated yet. So hopefully they get a update on that soon. Because we're already at September now. That's, you can also click for it and check for updates. So there, as you can see, that's the latest update for ASUS. Well, let's see. So as you can see, ASUS is not that uh, updated when it comes to the security patch. Maybe they'll be releasing an update soon to keep the security patch up to date so that's all for this video i hope you enjoyed watching and learned something let me know if you like the video hit the thumbs up hit the subscribe button uh, share this video to your friends who has an rog phone so they get to update their phone all right so until next time thank you guys and see ya